So I'm glad I'm glad that they brought this up and I'm glad that they also brought up Pharrell as well because I feel like this is essential when you have um these these artists, these influencers and you, and you collab with them on a brand like Adidas or Nike, right? The reason why Pharrell Human Races did so good cuz I remember back in what 2015, 2016 when the first Human Races came out um it was an amazing design, and I I'm, I wouldn't say I'm a big Pharrell fan, but um, I'm familiar with his work. Um, I know a couple of his songs. Shout out Neon Guts. <laughs> but Pharrell came from a background of fashion, right? He was working with Nigo. He was working with Kanye. So he's already in that realm. And with his shoes, you know what I'm saying, knowing his music or not, just knowing him as a person, you can tell that his influence was a had a direct imprint on the shoes itself. Now with Beyonce, you could tell because my mom is a huge fan of Beyonce, right? And she was the one who told me about Ivy Park. Um, I wasn't really, I was into, I was just starting to get into uh, shoes when Ivy Park came out. And she, she was the one who told me about it and I think she copped a couple of items from like the first release. But then later down the line, when I got more inclined with sneakers and stuff like that, I decided to, you know, surprise my mom with some Ivy Park stuff. And, like, I, I was looking at it while I was at the Foot Locker, and I'm like, where's, like, the branding? And it was just, it literally just looked like regular, like, women gear. And I'm like, nah.